podcast is sponsored by Easy Excel. Excel VBA Chapter 25, Suppress Alerts. Well, hey, welcome back to the Mr. Excel Netcast. I'm Bill Jelen. We're working through the VBA and Macros book. Uh, for Chapter 25, I want to talk about this one uh, particular situation. There's many times when we do something in Excel and Excel warns us, hey, are you sure you want to do that? Uh, one classic example is when we delete a worksheet. Uh, it brings up this message says, hey, there's data there. You're going to permanently delete this data. And you click delete to confirm that. Well, that's good when you're working in the Excel interface, but if you are running a macro, you know, the macro does 40 steps. It pulls in some data, creates some sheets, creates some pivot tables, creates some charts, and now needs to clean up and delete those sheets. Well, I'm not sure I want to ask the person running the macro if they want to confirm the deletion. In fact, I'm sure I don't. And besides, the whole point of a macro is to make life easier. You start the macro running, you go get coffee, you come back, the report's done. You'd hate to come back and have that message sitting there. So when we delete a sheet in VBA, if we run this macro, it stops and it says, hey, are you sure you want to delete? Yes or no? All right, so to prevent that from even popping up, we can use application.displayAlerts equals false. So that prevents any alerts from showing up. Now, after that line of code where you're expecting an alert, you should probably go back and change it back to true. That way, in case we get some other unexpected alert later, uh, the alert will pop up. All right, so now here we're on sheet two. Notice we're on sheet two. I'll uh, run that code. Uh, you can watch down here. Click run. Bam, it's just deleted. No warning, no hassles. Everything finishes. So, a cool trick. Especially if you're making macros, uh, you know, that do a lot of steps. You don't want to be asked that question every day. You can stop it from asking that question. Hey, I want to thank you for stopping by. We'll see you next time for another netcast from Mr. Excel.